Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to import your Stacimo fields data to WordPress post. For that, install and activate the Yoast Stacimo plugin in your WordPress dashboard. Let me show you the Yoast fields for the post we are going to import. Inside the post, you can see the widget Yoast SEO Premium. It has tabs like SEO, Readability, Schema, and Social. Now we are going to import values to the SEO tab, Schema tab, and Social tab. In the SEO tab, we will import values for focus key phrase. SEO title, slug, meta description, key phrase synonyms, corner store content, related key phrase, and also for the advanced section. In the schema tab, we will import values for the page type and article type. In the social tab, we will import values for Facebook image, Facebook title, Facebook description, Twitter image, Twitter title, and Twitter description. Now let's see the CSV file I have prepared. This is my CSV file. The CSV file includes two sets of fields. One is the default WordPress post fields and the others are Yoast SEO plugin fields. Let me explain the default post fields first. In the post title field, provide your post title value. In the post content field, provide the post content value here. In the post excerpt field, Provide the sort description for the post here. In the post date field, mention your post date. In the post name field, provide the post slug value. Mention post author in the post author field. And provide your post status like publish or draft. Mention your post featured image URL in the featured image field. In the post format field, provide your post format value. In the common status field, mention the value open or closed. In the post category field, mention the post category value. You can separate multiple categories in comma separator. In the post tag field, mention the post tags in comma separator. Next are the Yoast SEO fields. The title field is known as SEO title. In the SEO title field, mention the SEO title for the post to be shown in the search result. In the meta description field, add the description content to be shown on the search result. In the focus keyword field, provide the post keyword here. In the keyword synonyms, provide your post keyword synonyms. The next focus keyword is related keywords. Provide related key phrase in comma separator here. You can make your post cornerstone content by providing the value 1. Otherwise, you can mention the value 0. In the meta robots no index field, specify the value 0 to select yes, current default for post and 1 for no index and 2 to allow search engine for indexing this post 
insert yourself in the meta robot no follow field specify the follow values mention yes to let search engines to follow links on this post otherwise specify the value no in the meta robots advanced fields specify the multiple values in comma separator provide breadcrumb crumbs title here in bc title field mention canonical url for the post in the canonical field in the redirect field provide the redirect url for the post to redirect the visitors when they land on this post if you are promoting your post on social media then you can directly post the content from your seo the open graph is nothing but facebook in the open graph title field provide the facebook post title in the open graph description field provide your facebook post description and in the open graph image field provide a facebook post image similar to that provide twitter post title twitter post description and twitter post image in the schema page title provide the page type values like web page item page default for post about page a faq page etc in the schema article type field provide the value article blog post social media posting news article etc so these are the csv fields i have now let's import the csv with wp ultimate csv imported plugin go to the wordpress dashboard and visit the wp ultimate csv imported plugin page you can upload your csv from any of these locations now i upload from desktop this is my csv file select new item if you are importing new records if you are updating existing records then select this existing items and choose the post types here now i am importing yoast fields data for my post so i select this click on continue next map all the csv headers with wordpress fields the fields are automatically mapped if your wordpress field headers and csv headers have the same name make sure to map all the yoast seo fields After you map, save the mapping template with a name here. Click on continue. you can use this media handling section if you are importing any external image urls to your wordpress media otherwise you can skip this section
you can schedule the import process using this do you want to schedule this import option you can also handle the duplicate records importing using any one of this field Now let's import the CSV values into WordPress instantly. So click the import button. The import is completed now. Let's verify it. The values are imported successfully. All the used field values are imported successfully. So this is how you import used SEO plugin field values to your WordPress website using WP Ultimate CSV Importer plugin. Thank you for watching.